So we just have some of uh, some queens. You know this game. Just yes. tell us something fun, interesting, different, shady. Try not to just say they're nice. If you love them, tell me why and something good. You know what I mean? Okay. All right. Look at her. Oh, what? Well, we know she's Hello. nice, but I mean, tell me some she, shit okay. on this bitch. Uh, Juju is, will drink me under the table. Oh. <laughs> there are times where we've worked together lately and we always order a captain and diet and a, and a shot of captain before the show. And there's times where she's actually been like, I'm, I can't, I can't drink that. And I'm like, why girl? And she's like, cause I got fucked up last time. So <laughs> the one, the one time we were working in Dallas and we did a show the night before and then we were doing a brunch the next morning. Ooh. And both of us got up in the morning to get ready and we go down to have a cigarette. Yes, we smoke. <gasps> And um, <laughs> leave your comments below. <laughs> and um, we both looked at each other like, bitch, why did we agree to do this? Girl, and then as we run back upstairs and like <laughs> throw their shit on and then go have the best time and just get right, drunk again. Of course. So Juju will drink me under the table. Love it. Look at her. Adore. One okay. of the newest princesses. One of the newest queens and a fierce queen. And the one thing, and a lot of people think that I, I have this shade toward her and I don't like her. I watched Adore when she first started. Mm. And this is what I saw all the time. Fierce paint, body, costume, jewelry, hair. Right. And then I see photos of her recently in combat boots and a, a, and a Dare t-shirt in her, in her underwear. Uh -huh. And it's like, girl, you know, yeah, you're punk rock and all that and your album is fucking amazing. Yes, yes. Um, you still have to show up to work. Mm. You, you're, you know, you still have to go to work. You still have to show them, you know, this is, you know, and when you're done, take it off, run around naked, get right. fucked up. But when you're on stage and you're doing, you know, you're doing your job, show up for work, you know, and I know she's capable of it. But and I love, I love Adore Delano. I love her. I like that wise advice and a heart. <laughs> That's good. Mm -hmm. Yes, that was delightful. Um, look at her. Shangela, LaQuifa Wadley. I would know that hair anywhere. Uh, you know, Shangela, I, I, I saw her when she first moved here. I was working with her and I was like, who the fuck is this? Because uh -huh. she came out on stage with this wig that was just so crispy and crunchy. <laughs> and she was spinning around and it was, at, um, it was at Here Lounge. And she was spinning around and throwing herself on the floor. And that's the first time I saw people doing this Shablam Death thing. Job, shablam, and I yep. started calling it the Shablamjala because she was just <laughs> always doing it. And I was like, who the fuck is this? And then when I walked in and saw her on season two, I'm like, oh my gosh, she is one of the most fun people to work with. Very much, you know, the bitch is always running late. Mm hmm. But when she gets there, you are so happy she's finally there because you're like, bitch, I, we, we get to work together. I don't get to see her as much, but I just signed on with her. Uh, her agency, oh, Say okay. What Entertainment. All right. So we only talk through text or emails. But maybe you'll go on tour together. Maybe we will. Mm. All right. Say uh, what. Look at her. Oh, speaking of going on tour oh. with her, um, did you have you met Alyssa a lot? Do you know her? I do know Alyssa. Uh, I love her. Yes. Have you had her here yet? Not yet, but I met her at the Wow Christmas party. She's and she was just like a beaming angel with fur and face and hair and so and nice. And that gown she had on with yes. all those curls. Amazing. She's another one that I when I when I was watching season five, I was like, oh my gosh, I love this bitch. I fucking love her. When she went home, I was very upset. Um and then when I finally met her, I was so starstruck, I could barely like talk to her. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's Alyssa Edwards. I was like, can you do the thing for me, please? We do the thing. And so she, when, and another one, whenever we work together, it's those Texas hoes. Uh -huh. They're just a lot of fun to work those with. Those Texas hoes are do it big. Yes, look at her. <laughs> look at her, exactly. All right, there's one more queen, and uh, I know you're gonna, we're of course gonna say something nice, but look at her. Oh, Mama Roo. Mama Roo. Mama now, Roo. What, tell me just what you've been able, like your most private moment you've ever had with RuPaul. Well, we were working on Drag U. And I remember I, um, one of my friends had called me the night before and said, you have to read this blog. And we were filming the first season of Drag U while season two was still airing. And 
I, I was upset. I read a blog and this person just ripped me to shreds. And I don't care if you don't like my personality, the way I'm dressed, my hair. When you start attacking personal things, like like things about like my life that aren't even true and saying things like that, right. like that's when it hurts. Yeah. And Rue could tell that I was upset. And she pulled me aside and she said, what's wrong, girl? And it, and it was almost kind of like a snap out of it, bitch. Yeah. But I, and I, so I told her and she said, never read any blog online. Do not Google yourself. Do not look yourself up because you will sit there in a fucking, in a slum, in a yeah. K-hole, in yes. a fucking internet yes, K-hole. Like oh, hole. We're like, oh, fuck. Oh, so I don't, I, and I, I took that to, to heart and I had to try and train my mother my sister, my mm -hmm. boyfriend, my friends don't read stuff because yeah. you're gonna read something that someone says and you know, it's just, you, you can say I'm ugly, that you don't like me, but when you start to say personal things, it's when it really, it sucks. Yeah. So Rue, you know, telling me that made me go, okay, and I've never done it since. When Rue says it, you gotta do it. Do what she say <laughs> and do what she do. Yes. Raven, I love you. Next I time I you. want you to come on and I'm gonna give you a much shadier lineup and I want you to read some bitches for film. Oh, please, I wanna, <laughs> I wanna toot and boot some bitches. All right. Raven, I think you are great. I hope we can work together sometime or do something fun because I just love your energy. Well, thank you and I love yours. I think you're we'll great. Do, we'll do a music video. I just appear in, music, in people's music videos. Oh, well, videos. that sounds good. I don't do my own. I, you know what? It keeps you different from all the rest yes, of those bitches, the baby. Bitches. And you got a real cute boyfriend. He's Thank real you. cute. Congratulations on that. If Thank you want to see them, check out their Couples for Cash on World of Wonder. It's adorable. And you find out who does what to whom. Mm-hmm. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, it's been a delight to have you. You're beautiful. <laughs>